Cardiff Blues youngster Harry Robinson is the latest player to roll off the Sevens production line, having been named in the Welsh side to face the Barbarians on Saturday. The 19-year-old could barely contain his excitement when we caught up with him at Wales' base camp in the Vale of Glamorgan. Congratulations. How did you find out you got selected? Uh, thank you, first of all. And, um, you know, I'm sitting in the team, uh, team meeting this morning, so uh, the nerves are going this morning, but... Uh, you know, glad I've, glad I've got my place in the, uh, in the starting lineup. There are thousands of people out there who follow your every move on Twitter. What are you going to tweet? Oh, uh, I don't. You're a big Twitter man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I haven't really thought, I mean, Pete, I haven't really touched the ground yet, so I'm still a bit, uh, you know, still in the uh, cloud nine at the moment, but, uh, yeah, I'm sure I'll uh, let some of my uh, followers know what's happening. It's been a pretty rapid rise this season. I, I remember several months ago interviewing you when you were preparing to go out to the sevens, so it's, it's been, things have happened pretty quickly, haven't they? Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's been pretty non-stop. I mean, with the uh, the sevens and the twenties and the uh, and the seniors. But uh, you know, I have to say the thing that's uh, probably helped me most is going away on the sevens tournaments to uh, you know Australia, Dubai. I mean, playing on those stages and uh, at an international level, I guess paid uh, paid dividends to my game. And uh, all credit to the sevens for picking me to go. So, how as a winger has the sevens helped your game? Do you think? I mean. Uh, I mean, in, in sevens, you uh, you know, I know it was a cliche, but there's no hiding place. I mean, uh, any little mistake you make, oh, teams can capitalise on it like that, and you know, yeah. one little mistake and they score a try. So, uh, you know, it teaches you that uh, it teaches you you can't you can't switch off in sevens. I mean, uh, you know, one little uh, one little you know, if you don't look where your man is, they're around you. So yeah. Because a lot of people think it's like glorified basketball, but there's so much more to it than that, isn't there? Like the defensive duties, the jackling, that side, that side of things. I know it's uh, also the decision making. As a winger, you must love that sort of thing. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's the decision making in sevens as well. You know, if you uh, if you make the wrong decision, as I said, they can just capitalise and score. So uh, it's you know it's quite a steep learning curve because I haven't really uh, played sevens uh, sevens before before the uh, for the first tournament. But uh, you know, with the, with the coaching staff they have, with Paul John and. I think it was yeah, yeah, it was a great experience and uh, great help to my game. Would it be fair to say that Sevens must be doing something right because for the team against the Barbarians, there's nine players who have come through the Sevens system. I mean, yeah, I mean the you know the quality of players they're producing as well, like Alex Cuthbert, he was a Sevens boy, he did it for two years, and you know Lloyd Williams. So yeah, I, um, Sevens is paying dividends to the to players in the 15s game as well, and I see it as a as a perfect pathway for uh, for boys coming through to do the Sevens. Has Alex given you any tips? He has, yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, well, he told he told me to wear studs on the on the Millennium instead of blades because I want me slipping. But uh, yeah, him and George. I mean, you know, George is almost on 20 caps now, so it's uh, you know it's a great help having George in the uh, in the team because uh, he's probably you know, he is probably the most experienced winger in, in the in the squad now. So it's uh, great having George there. Yeah. So, what would your advice be to someone maybe coming through the system and they were offered the chance of playing sevens for Wales? Oh, do it definitely. I mean. Uh, I, I I can't I can't uh, I can't say how much has helped me in my game. So it's probably the best thing I've ever done, rugby-wise, and in, in my life is going away on the seven circuit. I mean, you have so, so many great memories and meet so many new, you know so many great people. So yeah, definitely. You know, if I if I could do it again, I probably would. But okay, I've got a test for you. Since 2006, oh, no. <laughs> more than 20 players have come oh. through from the sevens. You now have 10 seconds to name me as many of those players. Uh, Andy Powell, James Hook, Alice Cuthbert, Lloyd Williams, um, Scott Williams. Uh, Three seconds. Ah, I'm stuck. <laughs> Me. Me. The most important one. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Cheers.